Hi, Wilbert. Good evening. How are you? Hello, teacher. Good evening. How are you? How was your day? Fine, fine, teacher. Uh, I go well, thank you. And you? Good. With a lot of uh, information going on, they're closing many places, and you know, right? Yes, yes. The streets are very vacuum or vacuum, no sé cómo se Lonely. Uh huh? Lonely. They're actually, they're not a lot of people outside. You cannot see a lot of people outside, right? Yes, yes. Okay. Ovidio, good evening. Fatima, good evening. How are you guys? Good evening. Good evening. Good evening. Hi, Fatima. Hi. How are you? How was your Monday? I'm um, busy. Uh, no, it, it was a, a quiet, um, easy. Okay. What about the news? Like, are you guys doing something different? Um, are you going to start working from home? Or are you going to continue working, going to your offices? I continue working in my office. Okay. Yes, me too. Okay. Wilbur, what about you? Are you going to continue working in your office? Uh, Yes, teacher, but I have the possibility to work uh, remotely. Oh, okay, great. That would be mm -hmm. awesome if you can do that, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. I, I heard today that they, they closed uh, McDonald's, they closed like all of the food. Yeah. Uh, Pollo only, Campero. Pollo Campero, mm -hmm. yeah. So people are like, oh my God. So the only afraid. delivery. <laughs> See, only for delivery, yeah. Exactly. Only for delivery. So imagine the traffic, right? Yes. No traffic. People are gonna be like delighted to actually drive outside today. <laughs> Super happy. So it, <clears throat> yeah, yeah. I think that the positive side of all of this is two things. One, our planet is resting from you know contamination pollution. from pollution. Mm -hmm one thing and the other one i consider that we are spending more time in family that for some reason because we're always busy working we forget that that we have family and you know it's good so i think that i i see the bright side of it spending staying home spending time with your family quality time with your family so i think that in a way that's great and fantastic and you can I save think, money so it's a positive mm -hmm. You can save money. And you can also save money, of course, of course. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Okay, good evening, David. Good evening, Sadie. How are you? Uh, good evening. How are you doing? Good. A little bit sick. I'm starting to get like a sore throat, but I already oh. started drinking. Yeah, I know. My son was hospitalized Saturday <gasps> because oh. I thought, yeah, he, he was uh, throwing up and he was having high fever mm. so i i was i was worried but fortunately it was just the that he had something with his throat so that was making him throw up and that was making him have high fever he had a very big infection so they were able to you know uh, bring him down to regular levels but now it's me so i don't know if it's because i got it from him so i'm drinking also antibiotic and and just um, drinking, you know, regular like aspirins just to. Oh. So hopefully, yeah. But so my throat hurts a little bit. So I'm sorry if you hear me like ah, all of a sudden. Okay, so I'm sorry. I apologize okay. for that. <laughs> mm -hmm. Okay, guys. So tonight we're gonna be doing a fun activity. We're gonna get started with this. So I'm gonna give you like five minutes to do it. Um, first, I'm going to show you what is it that I want you to do. Let me see here. Are you able to see my screen? So you're gonna open up Word or if you have Word or on your notepad or anywhere because you're gonna be sharing your screen, all of you. So what you're gonna do is this. We're gonna we're gonna talk a little bit about whether using ger I wanna see how you use your gerunds or how you use your infinitives. You know that infinitives 
ger what are gerunds and what are infinitives? You might be asking me. Can you tell me what's the difference between a gerund and an infinitive? The what's a gerund? Gerund is you are doing something. Okay. Right in right. How do you say right now? In this moment, in this precise in moment. In this okay. moment, yes. Okay. And uh -huh. infinitive is only the action to do. Okay. So yes, infinitive is the verb without being conjugated, right? It's just in the regular form and the other one's ing. Started perhaps in the past, goes to the present and continues on to the future. So, but sometimes we tend not to use it correctly. Sometimes we still have difficulties when to use ing especially when not having a, an auxiliary next to it. Sometimes we forget, we say, I cooking instead of I am cooking, or I drinking instead of I am drinking. Uh, they working instead of they are working. So sometimes we tend to not use them correctly. Reason why we're gonna be doing this exercise. I did it in a infinitive way. Example, this is a game. You're gonna create like your own three. It, the game is called Two Truths and a lie, but I changed it and I, I made it a little bit more complicated to make it three truths about yourself in one lie. So this is me and you have to guess mine. So for example, uh, my first, supposedly are all our truths and you have to find out which one is my lie. So the first one is I am adopted. I used to race cars at a very young age. I have a twin sister and I'm super scared of giants. So I have four. So out of those four, you have to guess which one is not true. Can you pick a guess? Mm. I used to race cars. <laughs> so you feel that that's not true? Yes. Okay. Anybody else? Yeah, I'm scared of giants. I'm scared of giants, even though they don't <laughs> exist. Okay. Anybody mm -hmm. else? Nobody else? No? I'm, well, I'm guess what? That, yes, tell me. Sorry. I'm thinking that, that the lie is that you're adopted. Oh, okay. Um, guess what? Actually, I am adopted. I used to race cars and I am oh, scared of no. giants. <laughs> and my guy is that I have a twin sister. I wish I had a twin sister. Uh, I don't. That's my life. Um, you used I was to race cars. I really? Used to, I was. I was the first. I was actually one of the first females here. In in Hawaii, what happened is that my best friend he used to bring cars. He used to import cars. Ooh, back in the nineties. So I used to do freestyle. So it was. I used to be sponsored by Tony and Guy, which was a hair salon at that time oh. and, and with his cars but that was ooh, once upon a time long a time ago I, I cannot even remember it um it I stopped racing early. and I stopped racing because he passed away coming back from Manhali once so I decided to stop racing I don't know I would have been so I relate a lot every time I watch Fast and the Furious I feel like it's me back oh. in the 90s <laughs> 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 so now guys it's your turn this was my exercise so i want you to do the same thing in a word document or in um somewhere there and you can share your screen so whenever you're ready i'll give you like one or two minutes just do something simple okay i just mm -hmm. wrote down this on, and i added an image on the back you don't have to add the image on the back i just added this because i had time before but so Four things about you, but one has to be a lie. Okay, so I want you to elaborate. Your, your, your three truths. It, it seems that it was a lie, but <laughs> but make it difficult. So whenever we have yes. to guess, it's not that easy to guess. Okay, so whenever you're ready, mm -hmm. share your screen, please. Let me see. So work on it really quick, and whenever you're ready, just share your screen so that way we can see it and then we can find out which one's okay. your truth and which one's your lie. I wanna see how you're writing. I wanna see how you're using, you can do it in ING or you can do it in an infinitive. It's up to you. Mm -hmm.
-hmm. Make them interesting. That way we can. Difficult to guess. Ready? Almost? Mm. Oh, almost. 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 Okay. <clears throat> Who is using a cell phone? No, me. I am using a computer. Okay. Who's using a cell phone? David, are you using a cell phone? Yes, I'm using a cell phone teacher. Okay. So you're not going to be able to do it. So let's let's do it just like um, say it while everybody else types it. Okay. So tell me four things about you, but one has to be a lie, like the example that you you have on your screen right now. Okay. Cool. Mm -hmm. It's a I sent up a message. I will send you in a message. Oh, you, oh yeah, you can send it here through chat. Uh -huh. You can text it here on the chat. Okay. Four things. Uh -huh. All four things together, we have to guess which one's your lie. Text it. If okay. you guys don't have, if you guys are on your cell phones and you don't have Word available or notepad, you can do it through our chat, okay, as well. Mm -hmm. What I want to check out okay. is the way you're writing, too. Mm -hmm. Okay. Hennessy is almost ready? Almost. Super. Rosie? Yeah. Catherine and Ricardo, almost ready? Hey, bye. Yes, I'm ready. Okay, if you want, you can share your screen. <laughs> okay, how do you do it? You should have a button. Uh, yes. Uh, and it says. Okay, you, you have to stop uh, sharing yeah. your screen. There you go. Okay, wait a minute. Can you see? Yes. Can you watch? Okay. Yes. Okay, so tell us. Uh huh. Okay. Uh, do you want me to tell the, the things that I wrote? Uh -huh. Yes, with details, so okay. that way we can find out which one, where's your lie, okay? Ah, oh, okay, okay, okay. Um, I used to play basketball uh, when I was at school and at the university. Um, I, I play in the, in, the, in the school and the university team and also in the school and the, uh, and the university, we, uh, we won the championship. Okay. Okay. And the, the second one, I like to play football. Yeah, I, I, I like to play a lot of sports and football is one of them. Um, I have two beautiful daughters. Um, I don't like uh, beat. You guys know what beats are? Maybe in case anybody, do you guys know what beats are? No, I have to Google that. Okay. Okay, beat is um, the the one the Russian you Russian salad, Russian salad. Russian salad yeah. Russian you you, you use potato and beet. It's burgundy color, by the way. Burgundy. Ah, the, the, the color is um, like vino purple. in English is called burgundy. Yes. 
Uh, burgundy. Yeah, when you burgundy. have like that vino color, yeah, you call it burgundy in English. Mm -hmm. Burgundy, okay. Now, there's a difference between football and soccer. So, do you like to play oh, soccer no. or do you like to play football? No, I, I like to play soccer. Oh, okay. Okay. Yeah. So, thinking like, touchdown. I don't know. No. Okay. Oh. So where do you guys think it's a lie? What do you guys think? I used to play, so he used to play basketball. He loves or likes to play soccer. He has two gorgeous daughters and he doesn't like beats. I think it's easy. I don't know. It's just my perception. I what do you guys think? The, uh, I think the lie is, I like to play soccer. That he likes to play soccer. It can be, I, and maybe you like basketball or soccer, not both at the same time. <laughs> mm, okay. Aha, okay. uh -huh, usually it could be, right? Usually people who like basketball, they just don't like soccer that much. Yeah, see. Yeah, it, it's true. It makes sense. Anybody else wants to guess? He said the, the, he likes to play uh the old of sport. I think the the lie is he have he has two daughters. Okay, could be. I can listen to kids in the background though, but yeah, it could be. It could be. <laughs> <laughs> okay, anybody else? For me, I believe that the lie is that you don't like beat. Maybe. That's what I think. Okay. So enlighten us, please. Tell us where, where did we miss. Okay. The, the lie is that I have two daughters. No. Yes. Ah. Yeah. 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 Because I said, uh, uh, who, who said yes. that, that, that the lie was I have two daughters? Ovidio, yeah. Oh, Ovidio. Okay, Ovidio. Yeah, because I say that I, I like to play all kind of sports. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Okay. Uh huh. And I really don't like beat. Uh, my, oh, okay. my my father used to give me um, a juice of beet when I was a, a, a little boy. Beet juice. Uh -huh. I, yeah, I, I beet juice. Yeah, and I hate it. You hated yeah, it. Right oh. now, I, I cannot eat. I cannot see it because I, I don't like it. And, and I that, only have one daughter. Yeah, and now that, you, that you're saying that, I remember you were saying, yeah, the prices for school, they just, we just went to uh, her school. I think in one of the classes you mentioned, they went to her school and that you, you were told that the prices were going to come, you know, they were going uh -huh. to go up. So yeah, you said yeah. one. Yeah, I missed it. Okay. Yeah, right. Very good, very good. Yeah, I thought you didn't like pizza. I thought that was a lie. Anybody else? If you want, stop sharing. Line. So, okay. Yeah. If you want, stop sharing so any, somebody else can share it. Okay. Uh, how very do good, you... very good. Oh, okay, here. Yeah, stop sharing. Mm -hmm. Interesting, interesting. Okay. I have now you can line. share. Go ahead, Fatima, share. Can you see? Okay. Uh-huh. <laughs> <laughs> well, this is okay. mine. I used to eat powder milk with sugar when I was a kid. <laughs> I have one kid. I lived out of El Salvador for three years. Mm -hmm. And I am afraid of toads. What is toads? Um, like it's frogs? Frogs. Like sapo. Uh -huh. <laughs> like yes. frogs. Okay, okay. But there's a difference I'm going to show you. And then I'm going to show you the difference between turtle and tortoise too. Now that oh. you, you brought that up. Uh -huh. Okay. Mm. So you have to guess. I used to eat powder. I think everybody, every kid loved <laughs> to eat powder milk with sugar. Yeah. Or even just the powder milk. I don't know. No, yes. I don't. But. <laughs> mm. No, I didn't. You lost it. <laughs> <laughs> okay. 
Well, if I'm if I can guess, I think the the lie is that she's afraid of toads. Yeah, I think also the same. I I hear like a strong woman. <laughs> you you sound Sorry. like that. <laughs> <laughs> nice, nice, interesting. You, I believe you in that El Salvador for three years. I don't know, but that's just my perception. Maybe. What maybe do you, you live, Maybe you live. The fact that you lived out of the country for three years, maybe. Hmm. Maybe. Who, who else? Uh, I think uh, the lie is I have one kill. Hmm. Yeah. Could be. I hear too young, too young for that. Yeah. <laughs> you sound, you sound with a very young voice. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> okay. Anybody so, else? Okay. So give and more. Then, huh? <laughs> dun, dun, dun. Uh -huh. So tell and us. And the lie is, I live out of El Salvador oh. <laughs> <laughs> for I guess it. <laughs> I, I, I guess I, I it. Sound, like a real guanaca. <laughs> okay, I lived out of, yeah, I don't know. I just had that perception. I used to eat powder milk with sugar and I like it so much. And I think we I still have. do, right? Really? Like whenever we have the opportunity, I still, I think that sometimes we do yes. it. Yes, when my girl, I, I have one kid, mm -hmm. it's a girl. Okay, when, a girl. And she asked me, asked me to to give her a little bit of powder milk i i mm, how do you say aprovecho i take the advantage of uh -huh. <laughs> advantage uh -huh. of to eat a little bit and i afraid i'm really afraid of those okay really really i suffer Hi. it when it's rainy and we found a uh, um, Broke, told, whatever. Uh, no, no, I don't like it. Okay. So the winner is. <laughs> I'm the winner. Yeah. The teacher. Uh -huh. the teacher. Six cents. A teacher, six cents. Uh -huh. Yeah, see. <laughs> okay, thank you, Fatima. Like Great nice job. Thank sure. you. Nice, nice. Okay, so we have David. David, this is your first class, right? Welcome. Okay, so David does not have access to write Thank it down for... on a notepad, but he did write it on the on the chat, so you can guys check it out. So tell us your four uh, items, and then we're gonna find out. Okay, which one's the lie? Tell us, please, David. Mm -hmm. Can you read it to okay. us? Okay, I I used to ride a motorcycle, and I I love. I love to play soccer. Okay. And I I love to hang out with my friends. Mm -hmm. And let me see another one. I I prefer to drive to drive a car. Hmm. Again, please. Two. So there are four things. The first one. Four. All of them, I, please. Can you repeat? I used to. I used to ride a motorcycle. Mm -hmm. I love to hang out with my friends. Okay. I love to play soccer. Okay. And the last one, I prefer to drive a car. Hmm. I prefer to ride to drive a car. Oh, ah, yeah, yeah. But he used to drive a motorcycle. Hmm. What do you guys think? I think the lie is that he loves to drive a car. Ah, uh, yes. You are right. <laughs> that was like so easy. Come on, David. You should have waited for everybody else to participate. It's like, yeah, you're right. I cannot deny yeah, it. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> we see that face. The lie. <laughs> Liar. <laughs> okay. So you're like a biker boy, right? So you yeah. love bikes. Yes, okay. I love Okay. <laughs> okay. Nice. Interesting. Thank you, thank you, thank you, David. Anybody else ready? Sadie. I'm ready. Okay, go ahead, Sadie. You can share your screen or.
There you go. Okay. So tell us, please, a little bit. Okay, the first one is I've been in the United States. The second one is I learned English by hearing music from 70s, 80s, and 90s. Okay. The third one is I was a member of the Salvador basketball national team when I was younger. Okay. And the last one is I have two daughters. Hmm. Interesting. What do you guys? Hmm. Um. Maybe, I, I, uh, sorry, go ahead, Farima. Uh, I've been in the United States. I think that it is a lie. Okay. I think that that is between that he was a member of a Salvador baseball team and that he has two daughters. Yeah, me too. I think that he does not have two daughters, but... <laughs> Maybe he was. No, a I, I hear two daughters. daughters. <laughs> <laughs> I hear two daughters. <laughs> but the, 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 yeah, the no. background is that the background uh, noise is not from here. No, it's not from my house. <laughs> oh. <laughs> They're the neighbors that just came to visit, right? <laughs> it, it was recording for. for <laughs> yeah, we're recording. We're recording. Yeah. yeah. Okay, anybody else wants to pick a guess? Like if I've been in the United States. I've been in the United States, okay. Hmm. Sadie, what's mm -hmm. the lie? Okay, we got two winners. <gasps> really? Uh-huh. Yeah. The winners the winners are Fatima and Ovidio. Yeah. I never, I've never been in the United States. <laughs> really? Okay. Yep. You have Great. never, you... never visited the United States. Never. Wow. Me neither. Oh. <laughs> How do you ask in that in that tone? <laughs> I thought you, I thought you did from the bottom of my. <laughs> <laughs> especially Why because you, you work at, so? because especially because you work at the airport. I don't know. I feel that you guys get free tickets or something. I don't know. Just by working at the airport, or like you get those perks of flying. I don't know. I just imagine. I don't know. Oh, um, nope. it was just perception. Okay, it was easy. Very good, Sally. Thank you very much. Anybody hey. else ready? Ovidio, or we're missing Ovidio. We're missing Rosie, Wilbert, Catherine, Hennessy, Edu. wants to share now who's next i'm ready okay go ahead and share okay uh, you can see uh, can you see yes we can okay uh, the i like romantic <laughs> movies okay to wake up early, I have two children. Mm -hmm. Okay. Um, I, I have think two children. I know what, what, which one is a lie. So, <laughs> I think that the lie is that he likes romantic movies. <laughs> no, he sounds sensitive. <laughs> 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 uh, I think is the clear one. I used to wake up early. I, I think the same, because you need to work for to work. <laughs> no, I... but he sounds like he gets late. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe yeah. you love sushi and you just you love mm. sushi. So I guess mm. the lie is that you don't like sushi. Mm. Maybe. <laughs> Maybe you do. Well, uh, I say the, the the lie. You can tell us. You can tell yeah. us. Can okay. Uh, nobody got yes, right. Uh -huh. Because he's, I have two children. Uh -huh. I don't have so children. Okay. Ah. So remember, children is already plural, so you don't have to pluralize it, okay? Without the S. 
Okay. Because you have, uh -huh. okay, there you go. I have two children, okay? Mm -hmm. Okay, okay. So you're single, you don't have, you don't have kids? No, I don't have. I oh. am single, yes. Mm -hmm. You okay. like romantic movies? And you uh, love yes. <laughs> tell us, tell us your favorite romantic uh, movies. Don't be Some a king. <laughs> uh, I think The Notebook. The Notebook, okay. What? <laughs> really? uh, and he cried. <laughs> <laughs> Only the first time. <laughs> <laughs> yes, I think. Don't you guys love romantic movies once in a while? You know, especially now that we're in quarantine. Don't you feel like, I don't know, no. just watching men, something? Men can cry. Uh -huh. No, I, I, no, I don't, I don't no romantic. like romantic movies. No. Ah. You don't like romantic movies at all? Not at all. Uh, okay. No, I don't. I, I, can, I can't say that I hate it, but no. I don't like it. No, it's I, I, just not, it's just not something that you like. Exactly. Okay. If I have to choose between romantic movies and funny movies or comedy movies, mm -hmm. I, I always chose for comedy. Okay. Okay. Nice. Thank you. Thank you very much, Ovidio. Anybody else ready to share? Hennessy or Rosie or Wilbert? I'm ready. Go ahead. Share your screen, please. Uh, I have a song. I like it. So the first one is that, can you repeat them again? I'm sorry, we, is that your, it sounds very far away. Or you can write them on the chat, that way we can read them too, on the chat. You have a son. You said, right? I have a song. Okay. I like it remain uh, with fried beans. Ah, you like to eat remains of fried beans. Yes. <laughs> me too, uh, me too. I love it. I love that too. Remains of fried beans. With cream. Yeah. Really. Cheese. Say that again, the third one. Do you say mango verde? Oh, green, the green, green mango. mango, because mango is just a mango. Green mango, <laughs> green mango. uh huh. Green mango, okay. Yeah. Uh, but the sugar one or the salty one? Or the, I'm sorry, the acid, the, you know, like the sour one or the sugar um, one? Oh, acid. Uh huh. Um, oh, acid mango. Sour. And the fourth one? Uh, I like Peter Coffee. Peter? Coffee. Who is Peter Coffee? Peter without, Coffee. without sugar. Amargo? Okay, uh, without sugar. Ah, you like, you like coffee without Peter. sugar? Coffee. Black. Ah, Black. pure coffee. Black coffee, pure. okay. Is that I heard Peter. I thought, it, is he an artist? I don't know him. Bean. I heard Peter coughing or something like that. I don't know. Okay, so you're like, so where do you guys think it's the lie? The green mango, the coffee, the children, or or the kid, and the other one was, I forgot the other one. There was one more. Fried beans, I thought. Ah, yeah, this, yeah, the remaining of fried beans. I, I don't know what that means. The, the, you know, when, the remains. Ah, uh, yes. It's whenever your beans, okay, you fry beans, but then there's like a remaining at the end, you know, the last portion of beans that actually oh. you have to like clean the, uh, with the, the pan. bread. Uh -huh. Yeah, and you like, uh huh, so the remainings. It's like some people uh -huh. like remainings of rice when it's very toasted or the remainings of the beans. Uh -huh. I thought that the lie is the sun. She, she doesn't have a sun. Mm -hmm. She doesn't have a sun. Okay, thank you. Anybody else wants to pick a guess? Mm. Or the coffee can be too. 
<laughs> or the coffee. Yeah. Edo, you were gonna say something? Maybe the 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 mango. The, the green, green mango, mango, maybe, right? Uh-huh. Okay. Anybody else? Hmm. I also think the green mango. So tell us, Hennessy, where is the lie? Where is the lie? Say it again. I don't like it. I don't like pure coffee. What? Where is your lie? Which one's your lie out of the four that you said? Which one's your lie? I like drink coffee. Ah, you don't like to drink coffee. Ah. I lie. Oh, okay. I don't like the Ah, okay. No. Out of the four sentences that you said, you have to pick which one is lie, la mentira. Or all of them were truths. I, I used to steal my brother's treats. I used, I used to steal my brother's teeth. Oh. I used to steal my, my brother's candies? Okay, I have candy. I used to steal my brother's candy. Uh-huh, that's the lie. Ah, okay. What happened is that you said other four, so I thought those were the, one of those four were the lies, but I guess those are true, right? Okay. So you I do like coffee. So you do like coffee. Yes. Okay. Yes. And you have a son. Yes. And you like green mango. Yes. <laughs> and you like yes. the, <laughs> the remaining of beans. <laughs> oh, okay so all so in her case guys all four were true there was no lie so they were all truth there is no lie right okay don't worry about it okay it's just an activity so don't worry if there was no lie don't worry about it okay thank you hennessy and what about you your options tell me I, I already say the option. Yeah. What's missing? Yeah, I, I'm, I'm missing somebody. Oh, Catherine. Catherine, I'm sorry. Catherine, what I'm about you? Know. That was the last one. Uh huh. I'm just missing one. And Wilbert. <clears throat> Maybe Catherine's not connected. Catherine, are you there? Or maybe she's not. What about you, Wilbert? Tell us yours, or do you want to share your screen? I'm ready, teacher. Okay, share your screen. Okay, go. Oh, okay. So tell us, uh-huh. Okay, teacher. Okay, the fifth one, I am electrical engineer, but I work in the telecommunication sector. Okay. Be because my first work was in the telecommunication. <laughs> okay, your first job. Uh -huh. okay. So from the electrical, uh, I am practice, 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 uh, a bit. Okay. My, my major ex exper exper experience, I don't know. Experience? Experience is in the telecommunication. Okay. Okay. That's your forte. In English, you call it forte. My forte, or me, yeah. My forte okay. or my expertise is telecommunications. Telecommunication, okay. Okay. Mm -hmm. Okay. Uh, number two, I have a small dog. The okay. dog, dog's name is Jojo. 
Yo-yo like that. Yo-yo. <laughs> yes. Okay. Duncan. This is the name. Duncan. <laughs> Duncan. Duncan or click or click. <laughs> okay. Okay, the number three. Okay, number uh, three. I use it to run the on my bike. No? Okay. Uh, uh, when I was young, uh, right now I know run more. Okay. Okay. In the number four, I have on a space rocket in my backyard. <laughs> Obvious, no? I don't, yeah, I yeah. don't know, but <laughs> that was like so easy I to think, guess. I think it's the dog. <laughs> or maybe <laughs> I bet it's the dog. <laughs> but what if he has a toy? I don't know. What if he has something? Yeah. That is, it's a, looks like a space rock, and maybe it's just something he got yeah. at Hennessy's okay. or something. If, if he had kids, maybe. <laughs> Yeah, it's my fantasy phone. <laughs> <laughs> that's right, that's right. <laughs> so you would love to have a space rocket in your backyard? Yes, yes. I <laughs> okay. <laughs> when I, I have kids. Okay, yes. nice. Fantasy. Nice, okay. So you do have a dog called Yo-Yo? Yes, I have one. one oh, dog. okay. Mm -hmm. Okay, good. The reality name is, is Yo-Yo, yeah. Is yo yo okay? Yeah. <laughs> okay, great. Thank you. <laughs> okay. Thank you. <laughs> okay, guys. So this was part of the activities that we want. I wanted to do for infinitives. If you can, I'm gonna share with you. Um, let me just go here really quick. Are you guys uh, doing working on your platforms? Yeah. Yeah. Yes. Okay. Yeah. Have you done this part, the infinitive part? Yep. Are you there already? Yep. Yes. Yes. Okay. Let's see how good you are with this. Let's do the let's do the knowledge check. Analyze uh, are you to study the words with the word. Weather. So Weather. satellites are used to study the word weather. To study the world. This is a very difficult word to say. It's like saying three syllables, not word. It's very difficult. Like girl. It's like saying ghetto or world. World. Like having three mm -hmm. syllables. So you have to extend it. It's very the difficult world. to pronounce it. World. 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 It's about world in Spanish. World, but more like. Weather. World. Weather. Like weather. World. Weather. Weather. Like that? Weather. World. World. In Spanish, but you say world. Uh huh. To study world. the world's weather. World's weather. World's weather. World. Let me write it on the chat. Maybe I can just. World. Like how it would sound for me in Spanish for you to like have an idea how to say it in English. It's more like this. I can't text you right now. I don't know why. Well, I'll do it later, but I, I'm, I'm going to remember. N next one. Robots are sometimes used for performing dangerous stuff. Excellent. For performing. Dangerous. dangerous, dangerous, not dangerous. Mm -hmm. dangerous. Tasks, dangerous. performing, dangerous. yes. Performing dangerous tasks. Dangerous. For performing dangerous tasks, very good. Next one, you can use a cell phone. To, to send, send a message. Text message. To send text. Message. Send text message. Okay, to send text messages, very good, very good. People, oh, to send, this is moving. People use the internet. For making travel reservations. For making travel reservations. For making travel travel reservations. Travel. Yeah. Yeah. For making? Okay. Mm -hmm. DNA fingerprints is used 
to identify, to identify criminals. criminals. To identify criminals. To identify, identify, no, identify. I to identify criminals. Excellent, very good. Oh, this is super old school. CD ROMs, yeah. I don't even think they exist anymore. <laughs> like floppies. <laughs> CD ROMs are, are used, used for storing for storing and encyclopedia. And encyclopedia. 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 Very good. For storing oh. and is encyclopedia. Mm -hmm. Okay. Whoa. Partially correct. Where where did I go? People use the internet? No. For making. Ah, For maybe making. my mouse moved. For making. Okay. Mm -hmm. Maybe my mouse moved. But still I get the same yes. ponderation. Okay, very good. One of the things that I wanted to show you was a uh, two things that I wanted to show you. One was tots versus frogs, and the other one was turtle turtles versus corn twists. Okay, so we have always called turtles turtles, whether water or land. But guess what? There is a difference. See this one. So a tortoise is the one that we have at home sometimes as a pet. So, but we always call it turtle. And turtle is the one that we usually have in water. Did you know that? No. No. Interesting. Uh -huh. So see? So turtle, it's usually for water. And tortoise is usually for land, but we have always called it turtle, whether land or water, right? Yeah. Okay. They, they don't bother. <laughs> <laughs> yes. So just for you to know the difference, because we sometimes, and a lot, not a lot of people know it. Every time I present this fun fact in class, it's like, oh, wow, I never, you know, never imagined. We've always called it turtle, right? And the other one was tots versus frogs, right? I think. Yeah. Yo-yo. Yeah, that's yo-yo. <laughs> that's yo-yo. <laughs> Todd versus frog. Okay, see? Okay. Sorry for the bad experience <laughs> right now. Sorry. No, no, no. But yeah. So I guess it's rana versus sapo, right? I always uh, confuse them. I never know which one's a rana and which one's a sapo. I imagine this is a sapo and this is a rana, right? Sapo? Rana. Yeah, maybe. No. Yeah. Or, or all the way around? All the way around. <laughs> I can't find the difference. I can't tell. They they, they both look alike. Yeah. So, but yeah, yeah, I guess the two both are disgusting. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so that was one of the things that I wanted to share with you. And my last exercise, and this is something that um, I want you to start doing at home that will help you also improve your English. I usually go with. I don't know if you have seen this uh, short films. Uh, this one is in Spanish, of course, but it actually comes in with English subtitles. So one of the things that I do is to enhance a student's English skills is to have them correct subtitles. Because usually, as you know, even movies, right? Ghost. And in Spanish, it's La Sombra del Amor. Ghost? Mm -hmm. La Sombra del Amor? So sometimes <laughs> translations are not, like, accurate. So one of the things that I, you know, as an exercise, something that you could actually do is do this, just check out something, even though it's in Spanish, but if it has English subtitles, take away the sound and start watching it and start taking your notes saying, hmm, this is not, this translation is not correct. It, I think it should be this way or that way. And that way you can actually not only enhance your vocabulary because you're gonna learn new things, but you're, always, you're going to um, get to see if the translation done, it's actually, the right one for what they're talking about, right? 
Okay. So this is something that you can actually do. I use I usually use this kids um stuff like this one. I have you have you seen this short film, Cuerdas? Strings? Yes. Oh, yes. Okay. I have. I have. If you have seen it, it's a beautiful story, right? But you didn't know it was in English with English subtitles, did you? No. No. Okay, so this one's English subtitles. So what I do is this. I just take away the sound because it actually can be distracting. And I started checking it out to see if the translation, and I was able to find a couple of mistakes in the first five minutes. So then it's an exercise that you can guys do too. And that way you can improve your language or your communication skills, okay? That's one of the things that I wanted to tell you. Okay, guys. guys have any questions? No. No. Okay. Another thing that I would like for you to do is uh, this worksheets. I love them. I'm sorry. I continue with my live worksheets, but I really like the more exercises you do, the better for you. So if you have that talon de Aquiles, that cross that you might guys come across with, like if it's verb tenses, if it's present perfect, if it's... Um, gerunds versus infinitives. I mean, the two versus four. If there's something that you guys need to enhance or improve, go ahead and go to this worksheets that I really like a lot. They're called live worksheets. And you just type here the topic, that you, let's say present perfect. And it would say, okay, let me work on some pe present perfect um, exercises. And then you're actually gonna get worksheets and you choose, you pick which ones you need to work on, and then it will actually come up with the results immediately, okay? That's something that you can actually do as well to enhance your, and it doesn't really matter the topic. You pick here um, if it's yes, no questions, irregular verbs. The other day I was doing with another class, irregular verbs, which are very difficult for a lot of you, um, using the past tense and, and so on. So. I suggest that you pick up the worksheet depending on, this is a very good exercise, the one here on the, this one, in where you get the entire list and you have to actually write down all of them for the majority of, nevertheless, we know that there's more, like there's like 600 verbs, but then again, these are the most commonly used ones, right? So these are exercises that you can do. Um, I wanted to ask you before you guys leave, is there anything that you would like for me to share with you? Like, is there materials or books and something, or is there something you would like to, for me to share with you so I can do it throughout, through the group? If there's like something that you guys are interested in, uh, let me know. And that way I can share resources with you. There's a lot of re online resources that you can, you know, extra free resources, Ooh, millions of free resources podcasts, books, PDFs, depending on your areas. If you guys are into finances, there's finances books. If you guys are into um, a business administration, leadership, management, I mean, there's so many resources out there that are for free that I would like to share with you. If I, if I have it handy, you know, feel free to ask me and I'll, I'll just go ahead and share it with you, okay? Okay, thanks. Okay, Cookie Taters, it was a pleasure talking to you today. I'll see you guys tomorrow. Be ready. Tomorrow you need to have a lot of water because we're gonna do it. We're gonna do we're gonna do American accent training. Okay, we're gonna be doing pronunciation maybe tomorrow. Maybe you're gonna be doing tongue twisters, maybe you're gonna be doing so before that you need to have handy with you water, okay? Because your throat will get dry for practicing so much tomorrow okay okay please. i'll see I you guys be, be ready for tomorrow <laughs> thank you teacher you're welcome yeah. guys i'll see you Good guys night. tomorrow okay okay rest bye see you tomorrow good night good night good night bye guys bye Thank you.